Welcome to Makosi Network. Welcome to the channel. Today, today we talk about um, Chiefs being said to have lost or drawn with Amatax, but a lot of people are saying we lost, so that is things going out there. And also the DDC winning the Soweto Derby. That is also a nice thing to end the week for Kaiser Chiefs, but let's get to it. So, please, before we get to it, please like, comment, and subscribe, and thank you for the support of the channel, but please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. But let's get to it. So, Kaiser Chiefs, we saw some pictures of them. They played Amatax, etc., and there's a lot of news coming out that says um, Chiefs actually lost against Amatats. But the news isn't coming from like a reliable source, I would say. So in the video, I'm saying that Chiefs lost because for me, the draw is even a loss. So take with that what you will, because there's uh, someone who's more reliable who said Chiefs drew. So that person who said Chiefs drew, I think his name is Gilbert on Twitter, he said Chiefs drew. 2-2 two, two with Amatax and yeah so for me I took it that ugh, come on really like a a a lose and a draw for me is still a, a, a loss so the whether you want to say but she's drew I, I don't really care for me she's lost so in that I saw the pictures and I think the comments are very standard there what the comments are saying that are standard there is that it is very bad that our players look out of fitness. There's literally someone put a picture up of Umtetwa at Stellenbosch and Umtetwa at Chiefs. And Umtetwa does not look like he's in condition. It looks like he has gained weight. And we all know we've been playing complaining about oh Gosen Pilangobo and Keegan Dolly's weight. Even now we've started being started to see Castillo picking up some weight. So in saying that I am glad that Moose's contract is ending, even though I don't enjoy a black person's um, employment being like ending and stuff like that. But I feel at this point, Moose is honestly not doing the, the job he was called to do because our players can't last 75 minutes in a game. We saw the last time Uduba started the game, he was cramping by 45 minutes. That time the guy, like... He had no reason to be cramping. He plays DDC. He plays uh, friendlies with Chiefs. So why does he cramp, you know? And that's that's due to the fitness coach. That is something we can blame the fitness coach for. So that's something I saw them. The other big thing is that we have now essentially lost two games against a NFT team. We have lost two games against an NFT team and it is honestly not a great sign. Because my worry is, how do you lose? At this point, yeah, sharp, we're losing. But my worry now is, how do we lose? When a lot of you ask me, what do I mean by how do you lose? I'm like, guys, if we win all of the rest of the games of this season, playing nonsense football, but we're not going to win anything. Like, there's nothing we're going to win or there's nothing we're playing for. But if we decide that we just want to win the rest of the games, we as fans need to ask ourselves, what do you want from this, the rest of this season? Do you want a team that's just going to get good results that makes people start believing in Kevin Johnson? Or do we want Chiefs management to start telling Kevin Johnson to start playing the youngsters in different combinations for the next coach of next season? Because when I say this, I'm like, I would rather just end in the top eight, ne? And in the top eight, maybe if end number six or whatever the case may be, it's not a great finish. And I'm a Kaiser Chiefs fan. I shouldn't be asking for this. But I would rather end in the top eight, no Africa seating, nothing, but with us having already shown good combinations on the field. Us showing a combination of Temba Zwane, Kosin Pilano, Bom Fundo Villagas. Us showing combinations of Ntetwa, Mfundo Villagas, Du Shabalala, etc. Us showing us Duba, playing with uh, Jensen, playing with Dupree, 
playing with Modi here? How how about us playing Modi as an eight and Dolly as an eight, and then out wide playing like a Jansen, a Dupree, and a Dubai striker? These are the combinations I would like to see. You know, us playing because we know Sitebe is basically out of the team now, so there's no use us playing Sitebe. There's no use us playing Gonzalez. Gonzalez, even funny enough, I wanna ask why is why is he still at Kaiser Chiefs? If we if we all know the proof is in the pudding that he is not good enough for Kaiser Chiefs. The guy joined Chiefs and hasn't even scored one goal. He hasn't even tried to do something. He, it, you know, there's something I want to tell you about a striker. You know, a striker gets irritated when they can't get goals like you've seen Ranga Ranga gets very irritated when he sees goals when he can't get a goal or he can't make a plan that they start taking the job into their own hand they grab the ball they dribble one to player they shoot on target they, Gonzalez has shown none of that hunger he doesn't show the hunger that I am going to add muscle this guy and take a shot because I'm tired of not taking shots. I'm tired of just passing back to these guys, whatever the case may be. Gonzalez lacks that hunger, but Chiefs still keep him. We're wasting money. We're wasting a salary. We could be, we could have saved Gonzalez's salary and just kept Duba because Duba right now is fine. Like We could have just played Duba more. So that's all I have to say. And then with the Soweto Derby, I didn't watch the game, so I can't really comment too much on it, but I will watch like highlights and maybe I will catch the repeat of the game. So well done to Kaiser Chiefs Juniors for winning the, the Soweto Derby. Uh, from what I'm picking up from social media, etc., is that Unkosi, our number eight, and do Ram Ramashu and also our number six to eight. So Nkosi and Ramashu are six and eight. Apparently they really played well. And apparently Cheese is playing well from the back in the junior team. I obviously didn't watch the game, so I can't really comment too much on it. But I want to say well done to the boys. Because even if I didn't watch, beating Pirates after Cheese, the big senior team has lost to Pirates twice this season, etc. I feel like it's a... It's a plus, you know, sometimes we have to take the positives. So well done to the boys and thank you, my cousin. Please like, comment and subscribe.